It's a real thing now. It's on. He's a good fuck. Poor thing. Is that his name? I was gonna say that was your part. Your piece. You know, I, I love an open kitchen. <laughs> so you roasted them here as well? Yes, we roasted them in a hung oven, which cooks uh, vertically. Beautiful. That's the best part, isn't it? <laughs> it's great to fry with duck fat. You want to take that home? Nah. It's clarified butter. Oh, I love clarified butter. Clarified or glorified? Clarified, clarified butter, butter is glorified butter. I don't know what you doing. What I did with last week? Smells good. Passes yeah. the smell test. I might just invite you over for Thanksgiving. Mm -hmm. you, you can carve a turkey like it's nobody's business. I do. I do carve a turkey like it's nobody's business. And what was that? They just got to sauce to the side. Is it all local? Do you buy them local? Um, we buy the breed. It's not local. You know how it's like Long Island Pekin is the breed, the breed's name, which is uh -huh. just a coincidence without uh -huh. a G. Uh -huh. But. Um, but that's the breed we buy. I've been buying it from a vendor since 2004. Uh -huh. and I haven't changed. Um, so the breed is it, but where he gets it, no idea. But anybody local is really expensive. Uh -huh. Even when you're traveling, the place is advertised, oh, there's a Long Island duck. Well, never mm -hmm. that oh, no. Oh, no. Yeah. Ours is the Long Island Duckling, definitely the breed, but where it comes from. I like the knife. Good knives are hard to get, aren't they? I want to get a, uh, a flexible filet knife. Where, where, where did the chefs come from? The chefs are from Flushing. It's good. For, that works for me. <laughs> The one time I made duck in the house, I think I left it in the freezer too long, so it got real gamey by the time I, I cooked it. So, never got comfortable with doing it again. I like how the skin comes off so easy. Beautiful. So the process of peeking duck is, the first, first thing that we do is we cut a little hole in the neck, and we use an air compressor to separate the skin from the meat. It turns it into a duck balloon, basically. And we dip it in boiling water for a few seconds, and then hang dry it for a few days. But the skin gets really dry, and therefore it gets really crispy. And then when, when it's hung in the vertical oven cooking, the fat renders between the skin and the meat, basting both sides. I started doing that recently with, with chicken, just separating the uh, the skin from the meat ahead right. of the meat. It cooks a lot better. Oh, yeah. This is the chicken the same way. Whether you're roasting it or baking it, it's... It, Leg meat, we do it kind of like cold, shredded meat style. And you'll see what we do with the skin. Thank you.
the presentation right there. Mm. Putting the duck back together. There you go. Is it a Humpty Dumpty? It's a deep cut of the duck. Just like cutting it like a London boy. Yeah. Did we miss anything? Love the plate. The trap door? This plate. 